from the students of Penn State Meteorology, here is your Penn State Campus Weather Service forecast. Good morning, State College. I'm student meteorologist Tyler Danzig. Here's a live look outside Beaver Stadium. As you can see, we don't have a whole lot of clouds out there, and that's because we're going to get some high pressure that's going to cause some clearing into the region over the next few days. Current temperature out there right now is about 64 degrees with a dew point about 52 degrees, so it's not too uncomfortable as you walk out the door right now. We do have that wind at north-northeast at 8 miles per hour, and it's going to drive in some colder air into the region so that tomorrow it's going to feel a little bit on the cooler side. Here's a look at the current temperatures across the region. 68 in state colleges, we're on that warming trend throughout the day. Warmer temperatures to the south and east into the western portions of the state around the metropolitan areas. As we take a wider look across most of the state, again, those warmer temperatures are to the south and east into the western portions of the state. Taking a look at the radar right now, we, do, we did see some showers earlier this morning in the Pittsburgh area. Most of the region should stay dry today, however. Not a cloud in the sky again for most of the region, and that's because we do have this area of high pressure as we widen out to the eastern portion of the state. We do have this high pressure sitting up into the northeast, and that's going to drive some colder air into the region on your Wednesday. This low pressure out into the Midwest is actually occluding right now, so that should dissipate in the next few hours, next few days, actually, and it shouldn't affect the region much at all. Here's a look at your future cast. Temperatures later this evening, 65 across most of the region. Temperatures ranging into the middle 60s. And then as we take a look into your Wednesday, again, some patchy fog is possible into the north central portions of the state. That should burn off by, this af by Wednesday afternoon. As we get that colder air from the high pressure pushing into the region, temperatures should struggle to actually get into the mid-60s. So as you're heading out the door Wednesday to classes or to work, make sure you do bring a jacket because it will be on the cooler side on Wednesday. As we take a look into your Wednesday evening, again, those temperatures not really changing very much as we have that clear sky. So temperatures into the evening, again, make sure you do bring a jacket as they're going to be in the low 60s. Taking a look at your Thursday, again, we do see some patchy fog develop across the Allegheny Mountains into the north central portions of the state again. Again, this should burn off by the afternoon. Temperatures are going to steadily rise, are going to steadily rise, however, as we do have a shift in the winds into the south and east now, and that's going to drive in some higher temperatures across most of the regions. We do see 67 on Thursday afternoon in State College and some warmer temperatures into the upper 60s and lower 70s for the majority of the state. Looking ahead today, we can expect a high of 74 degrees. Again, mostly sunny, not a cloud in the sky. I don't see any at all. Um, those eastern, easterly winds at 3 to 5 miles per hour are going to drive in some colder air into the region and cause some colder temperatures for tonight and into tomorrow morning. And as we do see those colder temperatures only reaching into the f low 50 tonight, so it's going to be a very chilly night tonight. Patchy fog developing late into this, this evening and into tomorrow morning. And here's a look at your 7-day forecast. Again, mostly sunny skies for the majority of the week. Temperatures are actually above average for this time of year as we do have an average high temperature of about 71 degrees. Um, we do see get some warming temperatures later this weekend on Friday, Saturday, and Sunday ahead of a cold front, which will be our next rainmaker, which is only into later this week into early next week, into early next week as we do see that chance of rain on your Monday. Otherwise, the region should stay mostly dry for the majority of the week, a beautiful week ahead. I'm Tyler Danzig from the Penn State Campus Weather Service. Have a nice day.